Hey everybody, Crypto Mentor 99 How you doing? Hey, it's May the 3rd, 2018, Thursday. It's about lunchtime. Uh, I just got back from a long breakfast I had with a friend of mine. So the, the name of this video is going to be something like my crypto breakfast or something like that. Um, so I'm 60 years old, for those of you that follow me. And in my demographics, um, and for those of you that follow me, you know what I'm talking about because I've talked about it before. Most of the crypto age-wise age is, you know, under 35 crowd. So people in my age group, 60 to 65, there's like 1.8 or 1.6 or something people that even have any clue about Bitcoin, cryptocurrencies, whatever. So I go to breakfast this morning with a friend that I haven't seen in a while. And we I probably see him five, six, seven times a year. Sometimes myself, Mrs. Crypto Mentor 99, and his wife, we go out. We're friends. You get the point. So he had just sold one of his houses, not the house that he lives in, but another house. And at the end of the breakfast, I, I said, uh, I, I wasn't asking him how much profit he made in the house. I just said, hey, what are you going to do with the proceeds from uh, the house? And later he told me how much it was. And I was like, yeah, we're going to put it in the uh, stock market. I was like, okay. Like, that's certainly one option. And then as I paid the bill and we were walking out to the car, because I had about a 10-minute drive to take him back to his house, I'm like, hey, there's something that I want to talk to you about. I said, I'm not, you know, trying to sell you anything. I'm more trying to, like, cast vision for you for that money. And I said, have you ever thought about, or, no, I said, do you know what cryptocurrency is? And there was a bit of a silence. He's like, yeah. And that's all that he said, which told me that he didn't know that much about it because he did say, oh, yeah, I'm reading or I have a website I go to or coin market cap. He said, yeah. And then we got in the car and I said, have you ever heard of Bitcoin? Oh, yeah, that's that thing, he said, that ran up and now it's taking a nosedive. Like that thing, like that Bitcoin? I'm like, yeah. I'm like, well, you know what's going back up? And I tried to cast a little vision for not so much the history of cryptocurrency, but, you know, the dying fiat currency and, you know, start to consider making a change into some alternative investments, so-called, that are, you know, soon to be mainstream investments. And you know I'm talking about cryptocurrencies. So I didn't get the chance to talk to him about ICOs or some of the other projects that I've invested in, but it was a rather short conversation. And I was kind of sad when I dropped him off because, you know, he's got a nice chunk of change, nice chunk of change, that even if he put 10 or 20 percent into like a Coinbase or buy some Bitcoin, just anything, right? Litecoin or some of the other projects. So not super sad, but I was a little sad that he didn't ask me any questions like, oh, you know, what do you know about cryptocurrency or what do you know about Bitcoin and Litecoin? It was kind of me just maybe, I never thought of it like this until just now, maybe me exposing a weakness in him that he doesn't know anything about cryptocurrencies, which is a dear friend of mine. I was, and he's older than me. He's like, I don't know, is he 65, 66? And kind of retired. Um, so anyhow, all I'm, all, I've said all that to say people my age, 60 plus, actually 50 plus, don't know that much about cryptocurrencies. That's why I want to stay my whole life, I want to be a student. I want to be a student of cryptos. I want to be a student of life. I want to be a student of people. 
I want to be a student with my family and always know how to serve them and how to best honor them. And yeah, this will be one of several videos and I'll talk about that friend. And maybe we'll talk again. Maybe he'll ask me a question. Hey, CryptoMentor99, what did you mean when you were brought up cryptocurrencies? And, you know, so anyhow, but I'm sad when people, I mean, it's not going to ruin my day sad, but just kind of sad when, you know, there wasn't more of a two-way dialogue. Anyhow, thanks for being part of my crypto family. I got to go cut the grass. It's been raining on and off for three days here. And I will do some more videos this afternoon. But appreciate everybody. Thanks for subscribing. I'm up to like almost 2,200 subscribers. I'm living the dream. I am living the dream. I did an interview with Val from local coin swap off the chain, off the chart. Did a video two days ago with Karan, with Zinfin, off the chain, off the chart. Just great people, great minds, love the way they think, great projects, great people. Anyhow, thank you for being part of my crypto family. See you later. Bye-bye.